My name's Amy Shepherd, and I'm a social worker in Foster Swansea and I've been working in fostering now with Foster Swansea for six years and over these last six years I've had the most incredible opportunities to do some of the most fantastic training, learning about uh, vulnerable children and what they need to help them be the best possible adults they can be when they grow up. I've worked with just, I can't describe the amazing foster carers and my colleagues and other professionals that I've come across. And I guess what all these experiences have given me is just this wonderful opportunity to have this shared learning where I'm there with the foster carers and they bring what they've learned, I bring what I've learned and our experiences together. And we've really figured out uh, together how we can parent these children to give them the best possible chance in life. And I guess I've had to think about what impact that's had for me personally on my life. And I'm a parent now, I've got a little boy, he's two. And I guess an example of one of those moments would be, uh, you know, all, all parents have them. Maybe I've had 30 minutes sleep the night before and he's uh, pushing my buttons, he's throwing his third cup of milk on the floor. And in my head, I can feel that desire to shout at him. But I don't. Because it's like all these experiences that fostering's given me, it's like I've got a stop button there. And, and I don't shout. And instead, I'm, I'm curious about what's going on for him at that moment. I'm, and maybe I'll be playful with him. Or maybe I'll give him that attention that he needs because he's only two and he needs me to help him out. And, um, you know, I guess maybe even I'll stop and think, what do I need now? This is not like me to want to shout what's going on for my thinking and feeling. And I guess without those experiences that Fostering has afforded me over these last six years, you know, maybe I, maybe I would have been different, maybe I, I would have shouted. And I just think, when I see this wonderful little boy grow before my eyes into a kind, charming, generous, content, happy, wonderful little person, and I just think I'm so grateful for all those experiences that I have had. And so I guess the take home here is, you know, that, that fostering does change lives, it does change futures, and it'll change yours and all the children in your life.